Welcome to the Sahara Desert! <laughs> We are starting the day here at one of the highest peaks in all of Morocco. This is our backdrop here. This beautiful like red rock, I don't know what to call it, a beautiful little mountain peak. I'm here with Chris, back with Chris after filming the show. And we're here with our amazing guide, Dress. And he is taking us for the next three days, right? Yes. And he's gonna take us all around. We have an eight hour ride today. We're, we've been driving for maybe about an hour now. And uh, we got seven more to go. <laughs> this is gonna be a long day, huh, man? Yeah, but it will be good. I uh, I bought us some breakfast. Sour cream and onion Pringles. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. So if you get hungry, you let me know. Oh, thank you. I got you back here. Okay, thank you. We made a quick pit stop on the side of the road because as we're driving to the desert, I thought this was pretty funny and contrasty that we were driving through the mountains and there's snow right here. We're next to the snow-capped mountains, pretty high up right now, on our way over these mountain passes. And I thought it was just a great contrast to be right next to the snow as I, we're going to a desert. And there's snow. <sighs> ah! Ah! <laughs> We've made it to the highest peak here. In Morocco, we are between the two tallest mountains. One of these is a beautiful snow-capped mountain. Look at this. Whew. What a view. We are making our way a little farther. Everywhere we keep stopping is just beautiful, so it's hard. It's hard to keep driving when you keep going through all these beautiful, beautiful mountain passes. And uh, I really like this. This is like a, such a perfect day for this. Just a couple days ago, it was like completely raining and pouring. It wasn't very nice, but we lucked out today. Just had a little bit of lunch, and Dress has taken us to Ait Ben Hadou. Hadou, yeah. Ait Ben Hadou. Yeah. And this is the set of a million movies here in the desert. Most famously, it's in Gladiator, it's in Prince of Persia, it's in a couple episodes of Game of Thrones in season three. Uh, it is the place I've been wanting to see for a very long time. This is Ait Ben Hadou. Look at that. We are climbing all the way up there, and then we're gonna go all the way down here to get the most famous uh, shot of this, this little village. This is the new town right here, and then this is the old town, so. Only a couple people still live in this. It's more for movie sets now. Uh, most people live over here, and then tourists just like walk through here. So it's pretty cool because, you know, all the desert movies have pretty much shot somewhere around here. Um, so that's, that's pretty cool to see. Like, this is a movie set for Game of Thrones, Assassin's Creed, Prince of Persia, Gladiator, all these action movies that I love. We've made it up to the top, and look at this view. Dress, have you ever been an extra in a movie? No. No? What was this, do you know what this was used for? Huh? Like, what was this? This one is like for the, to watch what's coming. Oh, so it's a watchtower. Yeah, because the, if you can see, it's, this one is a fortified wall for the, yeah, yeah. the big gas bus, uh, they have to watch out what's coming. So it's the watchtower. Um, yeah, yeah, it's watchtower. You can see for miles away. If there's another army coming, dress is going to be the first to know. Yeah, of course. <laughs> it's so crazy that an hour ago we were freezing in the snow-capped mountains. Then we we're here in the desert in this beautiful oasis right on the river where there's this river running through and all these palm trees and different trees and vegetation. And then outside of here, it's just nothing but sand and desert. So like this is the, like the little bit of vegetation, which is probably why it's so popular because it's, you know, it's really nice here. It's famous and movies are shot here because it looks insane. But as soon as you leave here, you're gonna just see it's all just desert. It almost looks like the Grand Canyon and uh, you know, areas out there. Gladiator production. No way. <laughs> it got dark really quick. Oh, there we go. Whoa! Oh, yeah. Very nice poor look. 
Is this where they film Gladiator? Yeah. Prison. This is, where they film this is the prison. Decoration, huh? Props. Huck. Oh, Huck. look at that. Real one. props. One, one. Oh, no way. Me. The real. Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Hey, Dress, you want to fight? <laughs> you got a sword? I get my own sword, but... Oh, gosh. What is about to happen? Dun, dun, dun. Oh, that's a spear. <laughs> yeah, a spear. I think this thing's real. Yeah, oh, it's not sharp, but it's real. Oh, it ah! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Kalishi. Oh, look at that. Sun. Oh. That's so cool. So, that's Kalishi right there. Yeah. Oh my god. That's awesome. Arena. And then this is them in Game of Thrones. Yeah, Arena Gladiator. Oh, wow. Gladiator. Uh, arena. Oh. arena. Oh, that's so Figaro. cool. So did they, did yeah. they build the arena? Friends, yeah. de Francia, Gladiator. Oh, wow. Plateau. Right here used to be the arena for Gladiator. They took it down, but it was a giant circle right there. We've made it now down to the bottom of Ait Ben Haru. Ait Ben Haru, I believe. <laughs> yeah, I got it right. All right. And we're at the gate here. This is a pretty famous gate. It's in a lot of movies. And uh, there it is. I had no idea that this was a part of the tour. So just coming here out of the blue, I was just like, yes, we're gonna see this amazing place here in Morocco. And I'm so stoked that I'm here. This is something I wanted to see for a while, but I wasn't sure if I was gonna get to do, but we did it. So when you come down here to the river, this is where a lot of the kind of establishing shots are for the movie because this right here, this kind of shot is the most most common picture that you'll see. And uh, yeah, this is this is on the poster. This is like the postcard everywhere here. This exact shot. Morning Dress, how are you doing this morning? I'm good. We uh, have started a new day here and Dress has taken us out to this area. It's very much like out in the US. We're at this place right now called the Monkey's Paw because these rock formations out here look like a monkey's paw. And it's pretty early in the morning. Uh, the sun is still rising over there. It's actually 8.30 which is kind of crazy because the sun is just coming up over the mountains. But it is beautiful and these are the Monkey Paw rocks. And uh, we're actually heading to an area just after this, which is called uh, Destade, which is kind of like the Grand Canyon of Morocco. This, I love these like winding roads. This is perfect. Yeah, yeah, this is the winding road that we took from. Whoa. Look at this little hotel on the side that's like blending in. Yeah. That's so cool too. We've done it. We've made it to the Grand Canyon of Morocco. Yeah, the famous road. Famous road. It is a beautiful road. So is this a road to like, is this, are we technically by the Sahara or we still have like a good amount to get to the Sahara? Yeah, we have to go further. Further, okay. So we're not in the Sahara yet. It is a cold, cold morning here. But you can see this giant like, it looks like the Grand Canyon. There's this giant like craters. I feel like it would be an amazing walk to go down here through the water, through the little valleys, all throughout this mountain. But this is just a beautiful sight to see this morning. These mountains in the background. Just just bought two of oh. these scarves. Thank you so much. Thank you, man. You wake up. Can you show me how to put it on? I show yeah. you. The yeah, guy, you can show me? All right, cool. Can kind of my kids? Oh. Oh, cool. <laughs> nah. Picture yeah. together with Ooh. Mirbe. Inshallah, <laughs> Africa. People in Africa. <laughs> Thank you, man. Yeah, put Africa. Africa. Tajin. <laughs> with the gas base. Tajin. <laughs> we have officially made it to the Sahara Desert. Guys, we've been driving for about five hours. We've got our blue scarves now. We are all ready to go out into the desert. The Sahara Desert is just right here. It's kind of crazy because we've been driving through the most flat land you've ever seen, and then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, comes the biggest dunes in all of Morocco, down here in the Mergoza uh, sand dunes. And we are loading our uh, our equipment now into Merzuga, sorry, Merzuga dunes. And we're loading all of our stuff into this four x four that's taking us out into the Sahara Desert so we can see sunset. It's gonna be a good time. How's it going, man? 
Yeah, I'm yeah, Cody. Man, yeah, What's welcome. your name? My name is Amar. 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 Nice, nice to meet, meet you. you. You're welcome. We're gonna have a good time tonight, huh? Yeah, inshallah. I'm excited. I'm really excited. This is the first time I've ever been to any kind of dunes like this, especially the Sahara Desert. I'm Cody. Yeah, nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. Nice What's your name? Hassan. Hassan? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Do these camels have names? I'm going to give him a name right now. <laughs> we money, got money name. Many names? Many yeah. names. <laughs> that one's yours. I'll this one, his name, his name is uh, Blade. Blade. <laughs> <laughs> one thing that's a little unfortunate is I feel like I'm coming down with a cold after 20 days of filming here, filming a show nonstop. I've been sneezing all day and here I am in the coolest place ever. I feel like crap. <laughs> I guess that's just how it goes sometimes. Hassan, how close are we to Algeria? Yes, Algeria on the hill. Right there. The big mountain out there is Algeria. Oh my god. Can we sneak in? <laughs> Can we sneak into Algeria? No. Ah, oh, darn. No? Is there a border patrol? On Algeria? Yeah. Border. Do they have a border? No. No? Oh, nice, yeah, we we're going. I think it's day 28. No sign of water. I've been seeing mirages out here. Pretty sure I saw a Coca Cola machine. But then I ran to it and it was nothing but sand in a bush. I need water. Luckily, me and my camel blade, we've been surviving, cuddling for warmth at night. Chris and uh, Jimi Hendrix, they don't want to. They don't want to get close. They, they sit on the other side of the campfire. But me and Blade, we've built a special bond. These 28 days have been amazing. Still no Coca-Cola cans though. Yeah. You think if I take a good enough picture here, I can sell this as a desktop to Apple? Yeah, definitely. Yeah? Easily. All right, cool. Let's see. One of these should be good enough. Thank you, Blade, my trusty steed. You boys stay here, Jimi Hendrix and Blade. We'll be right back. Check this out. This is my legit shoe. <laughs> oh. oh man. So, you could say it was a successful day. I hope they have some vitamin packets <laughs> there. Oh. Emergency packets. I need emergency. Yep. Do you guys have emergency packets? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, yeah. there you go. You We're got good. Emergency packets. <laughs> We rode through the night to get to our camp. We had a wild time. Yeah. It was insane. But this camp looks in even more insane. Oh, wow. Here we are at our camp. It's lit up so nice. Here is light. <laughs> mm. That bed is huge. Nice. Oh, this is amazing. Perfect. And get one for the charge, the phone. Oh my god. Oh wow, look at this. This is so nice. Look at the shower. You need a shower and a toilet also. You a toilet. This is hot water and a yeah, water. Us. <laughs> this is beautiful. Oh my goodness, look at the shower. And Wi-Fi? Yeah. In this town, in the desert? Yeah. No. Yeah. In the Sahara Desert? Yeah. You're joking. Yeah. You are? Yeah. No. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Oh my okay. god. He's not joking. <laughs> Surrounded by all these tents here. And the big one right here is the main dinner tent. Dress, I think this is some of the best meal and housing we've had. Yeah. In all of Marrakesh. <laughs> and we're out in the desert. And the Wi-Fi. It's incredible. It's so fast. <laughs> this is the best. We save the best for last. Yeah. Yes. 
but sorry, sorry for for this one. Oh, can't yeah. find it. Oh. For uh, the wheeler. Oh, sometimes here, yep. sometimes metal. Excuse me if I sound kind of sick because, well, I am. The hot shower felt really, really amazing this morning, uh, but it's still really cold in this tent when you wake up in the morning. Um, the Wi-Fi is incredible. I'm downloading like a season of a show on Netflix <laughs> right now, so that when uh, when we drive nine hours back to Marrakesh today, just nine hours straight drive, uh, I'll have something to watch for nine hours. But it is bright and early in the morning. We're about to go catch sunrise in this. This is what our tent looks like, or I mean our camp looks like in the morning. Right before sunrise. The sun is rising for the morning. It's a beautiful, beautiful sunrise. A little chilly, but what better place could you ask for a sunrise than in the middle of the Sahara Desert? Morning. How are you doing today? Cold, but we got that. You can't really complain. Cold, but pumped. Yeah for a morning in the Sahara. Let's go get some shots. We're walking out here in the desert. We uh, we thought we were gonna be taking camels or some kind of truck out here in the morning. So we got up before sunrise, but uh, unfortunately they said that was after breakfast. So we were like, oh damn, we're gonna miss the sunrise, which is the whole point of coming up early in the morning. So we walked about 30 minutes into the desert, which is why I'm dying. I'm also sick, but we're gonna walk a little further. Just keep in mind, if you do go to the desert, you're probably gonna to wanna to walk out into the dunes early in the morning if you wanna get some cool pictures. Run to me. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh no. No, not again. Not again. No. All right, Rogue Nation, thank you so much for watching. We have had an incredible week. You see that? See what? There's like a... It's like something is shiny. What? It's like something is shiny out here. What? Dude! What the hell? What is that? Oh my god. I don't gosh. know, it looks like some kind of magic lamp or something. <laughs> they definitely don't sell these in a market in Marrakesh. It's only found out here in the middle of the desert. That's crazy that we found this. What a coincidence. Maybe if we rub it, something will happen. <laughs> I guess we gotta wait for Will Smith. <laughs> <laughs> that is it, Rogue Nation. Thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, explore the world. <laughs> <laughs>